going on everybody I haven't made a video in a long time just been busy doing other stuff and I'll oh, just rolling with the punches here about was uh I was lucky enough to uh, pick up this 1986 Ford LTL 9000. Picked it up uh, uh, about a week and a half before Christmas. About three weeks ago, I'd say, maybe, give or take. A little nervous. I don't really do stuff like this, but I flew out to uh, Portland, Oregon truck was about 30 minutes from Portland drove it home old friend of mine came with me wanted to take the trip he met me out there and I drove it back to 1986 with a 400 B model cat 15 speed 373 Rockwells, new way air ride. Pretty much original truck. Don't mind the mess I've been working in here, cleaning stuff up. Pretty cool though. Not too bad for an old truck. Sleeper's in really nice shape. Starts right up. My goal is to fix this one up and run it. Doesn't need much. Little odds and ends, a couple wheel seals. A little bit of tinker in here and there. Probably one of the nicest trucks I've ever driven, even compared to some 379 Peterbilts I've owned and my Western Stars auto car or anything really comfortable to drive went down the road really good I forgot how nice a 15 speed and a B model cat is probably my favorite uh, favorite setup uh, of any engines and transmission setup there is that you could have Personal preference, I guess. I don't know. I've always had a thing for these old LTLs. I like rare oddball stuff, I guess. I don't know. In my opinion, this thing's cooler than any Peterbilt or uh, Kenworth out there. It's the same way I feel about old Western Stars and stuff. I shouldn't say it's cooler, but just as cool. Just as cool or good looking as any Kenworth or Peterbilt of that era. I feel like they were another overlooked truck. Like the auto cars and Western Stars. Now let's try to take it for a little ride. Things is this cool parking brake lever. Different. Pretty cool Ford thing, I guess. Let's go.
y'all get a little, uh, I'll get a little, uh, I'll step, uh, I'll step it up a little bit. Maybe I'll get a GoPro or something. Get some outside uh, views of driving. Or a, uh, what, what are those things called? A drone. I think that's out of my, uh, it's above my pre grade, I think. I'm not a professional YouTuber. I'm not a professional anything, honestly. <laughs> Stop up here, I'll get some more outside views of it. get some more views of it. Definitely has a good look to it. Put that new bumper on. I like it. I went with those factory oval holes in the bumper. I always thought they were for a tow, tow hooks, but I think it's so you could set your feet in there and uh, and open the hood. Hood's pretty heavy. I got a model of an LTL on my dresser, and now I got one. Wish things were a little bit more busy so I could do some fun trucking with this thing. It'd be really cool to take it down to Florida or something, out to California. Well, that's it for now. I'll try to make some more videos of it soon. Get some good ones of it driving or something.